Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Plan B Success. Let me begin with wishing everyone a very happy Thanksgiving this year. If you look forward to inner joy, peace, and the ability to reach out and help others, cultivate an attitude of gratitude. Appreciation of life and everything it offers you is a conscious choice that comes from being grateful. Often, we forget to be thankful for what we have, who we have, and where we are in life and take things for granted. We may lay blame on the busyness of life we have surrounded ourselves with, but that's no excuse. In the day-to-day busyness that we surround ourselves with and the daily stress we endure, we let life slip through our fingers. We exist but forget to live. Your life is only as perfect as you make it. Things happen to every one of us. What you can control is your reaction to it. And how you react can make the difference in how you design your life and influence those around you. By cultivating an attitude of gratitude, you tend to see beyond the issues and challenges that stare at you. It allows for a vision where you see beyond what's apparent. You're also able to react in a constructive manner than just what's generally expected in a situation. When you're thankful, you're never alone never helpless and never beyond redemption, no matter the challenges you face. Being grateful is recognizing the little things in life we generally tend to take for granted, like being able to wake up to a new day every day, seeing the smiling faces of your loved ones, being able to take up a day's work productively, being able to enjoy the sun out there and so on. Everything in life is something we ought to be grateful for since nothing can be attributed to what you deserve outright. There's a reason you're in the place you see yourself today. When you learn to express gratitude, it's independent of your circumstances and tends to become a habit. When it's a habit, it tends to bring out your best in any situation and thus allows you to see the best in life despite the circumstances. Your mindset is the key to what you can expect to extract out of your life. If you maintain positivity, you'll see solutions, else you'll only see challenges. By cultivating the humility to be grateful for what you have, you allow for happiness and inner peace to find their way into you. In a day and age where we talk about emotional and mental health challenges, what better way to take care of yourself than to be grateful? Focus on a life of abundance than one that craves for more. Focus on cherishing what you have and you'll find fulfillment. Chase after what you don't have and you will be chasing for life. For the craver, abundance is a myth. In order to develop an attitude of gratitude, start with some conscious effort on your part. Perhaps wake up each day and count your blessings. Be thankful for them. By developing a habit of remembering all that you're grateful for, you'll surely cultivate the attitude you need to welcome fulfillment and true joy. Share your love and gratitude with others openly. Appreciate them and let them know of it frequently. Often, we forget to thank those in our life for we may take our relationships for granted. But just a quick word of thanking them consciously can mean the world to them. It will alter your relationships magically. At the same time, always be open to forgive and forget. Do not hold vengeance for it only hurts you more than those you hold it against. Learn to celebrate those around you as well as celebrate every reason to be happy and thankful. Nothing is too small or big when it comes to recognition and celebration. While we are accustomed to chase after the next big goal, Taking a moment to celebrate the small wins can do wonders to your attitude, your relationships, energy and zeal to go after that next big goal with renewed vigor. Cultivate self-awareness and retrospect on your progress from time to time. Make sure you track your progress through your journey of humility and gratitude. Let me assure you that it will transform you, your life 
health, wealth and happiness. Not only will you be able to recharge, renew and replenish, but you will spread this in abundance to others. So let's begin your journey toward an attitude of gratitude. What are you grateful for? What would you like to express your thanks for today? Start your journey of transforming gratitude into a habit today. Cultivate it every day and see your life change. I hope you liked that episode and are enjoying all the episodes in Plan B Success Podcast. I'd encourage you to go subscribe on your favorite platform, whether it's any listening platform or YouTube or wherever you listen to podcasts. Make sure you subscribe so that you enjoy this content and extract from it what serves you best, what benefits you in your own life, personal, professional, business, whatever it might be. Plan B. Live is the website where you can go in order to find any episode that you would like to listen to. Three times a week, we release episodes, the first being an inspiring interview with someone who's done it, been there, done that, and can inspire you to go after what you want to achieve. Every Monday, that's the episode that gets released. And then, on Wednesdays and Fridays, we pick a topic and we talk about it in order to benefit you in your personal and professional life. At the same time, if you're someone who's interested in learning more about these concepts, if you're someone who's interested in podcasting as well, go check out planbsuccessschool.thinkific.com. That's where all the online courses are. You can learn and benefit from them there as well. There's a bunch of free courses. There's a bunch of paid courses. Start with the free ones. Get to learn what you aspire to learn. And if you want to delve deeper, then you can sign up for the other ones. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.